Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to install a new gas cap on your 64 and a half through 68 Mustang. So as you can see here, our gas cap is pretty damaged, cracking, pitting all over it. Uh, the Mustang is supposed to be in red, it's faded, and the Ford is supposed to be in black, and it is also faded. And it kind of just looks bad compared to our pretty nice chrome taillights and the bumper. So I went ahead and ordered a new one. This is a Scott Drake one. Um, I'll link it in the description below. I also got one on my 66, and I'll show you it right now. As you can see here, got the new one on the 66 as well. Here is the old one. It looks a heck of a lot better. Uh, again, it's a Scott Drake one. It fit perfectly. It took me five minutes um, to install. It installs just like the 64 and a half. So I'll go ahead and link that part in the description as well with the 64 and a half gas cap. And uh, let's jump back down to the 64 and uh, go ahead and start the install on it. This is a lot nicer than the one that is currently on the Mustang. Uh, a lot shinier, not really damp, no cracks or anything. This is of really good quality. Scott Drake is not paying me I or sponsoring this at all. I bought this. I also bought the one for the 66. Um, it's just a good quality gas cap. I would highly suggest it. They're pretty cheap. They're like 40, 40 to 50 dollars for just the standard gas cap. If you get the pop open, like I need to get for the 66 here. As you can see here on the 66, it has the standard gas cap which it's not supposed to have. It doesn't even have the cable that it's supposed to have on it. Um, this is supposed to have the pop open gas cap because it has the exterior decor package on it when it was ordered from the factory. So it has the wrong gas cap. So I have to order the exterior decor or the pop open gas cap, sorry, um, for this car. So it matches the group that it has. But that is a video for a different day. We are going to go ahead and install this. So the only thing you need to install this is a 7 16th wrench and keys to your trunk so you can get inside to open it. So let's go ahead and hop in the trunk and unbolt it. So now that we're in the trunk, right here is the bolt that you have to take off for the gas cap. I would suggest doing it while the gas cap is on. It just makes things easier. So just go ahead and get your wrench in there. Just like that, it's off. Then you can come back out here to the outside of the car, twist it, and then this one is currently stuck on the gasket. You might have to actually thread it off. And just like that, it's off. So now that I got it cleaned up, go ahead and install the new one. So take the nut and the washer off go ahead and slide that in there and i'm going to go ahead and put the nut on the back side now while it's like this and you want to have it resting like this and not like this so that it's facing down because when it's facing down you won't be able to get it on you want to be able to see the horse you want the horse facing out so now that we're in the trunk and hopefully see if i can't get my fingers back there yep get the nut on so once you got it on there snugged on there nice and tight come on out here and then you can take your gas cap and Put it on. And just like that, we have a new gas cap on the Mustang. Looks really nice. Makes the back end of the Mustang look really nice since all the other chrome is nice and shiny. And that's a quick, easy five minute job you can do to make your car look a whole lot better. So thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys here next time and uh, have a great day.